Well, hey guys, and welcome to uh, another episode of Pokemon Sword. I'm gonna probably be looking for this a certain Pokemon called Nicket that they've won very bad. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, we're back. Pokemon Sword. Cool, Hami, did you hear that just now? The gate's open and that Wooloo that was there. It was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. Don't you think it actually broke through there? Do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterward. Well, Hami, what do you say? We've got to save it, right, right? Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do it. Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in. All right, let's go. Wait, how's Squirrel Bunny doing? Okay, good, he's still full health. All right, let's go. The slumbering weld. That Wooloo, where do you think it got off to? The fog is really coming on thick now. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Ooh, some Pokemon already. Yay, he looks funny. He is too, but his cheeks are too, oh, too chubby. All right, let's Ember. Pew. Man, I thought that would beat him in one hit. Oh, my defense fell. Amber. Yeah, he's dead. Need to do as much of this stuff as I can so Score Bunny can get to a good level. Oh, hi, Hop. Hello. Oh, so Hop heals you. Hmm? Ooh, another one. Ooh, it's a rookity this time. Oh no, I can't eat berries. Well, I don't have anyone, any berries, so. Doesn't really matter. Oh, Peck. Haven't seen that move yet. There's Ember. He's dead now. Gain the XP points. Only nine. That's boring. What was that? Did you hear that? Was that a Pokemon crying out, you think? Oh yeah, heal me, please. Push on. <gasps> Is this a Rookity or a Squawfit? It's a Squawfit. Oh, score bunny. Take him down. He will be dead. Shoot the fire, get him to have health. Ember him again. You want fire now and you're you burn to death. Goodbye. Okay. Any more Pokemons? Nope. Ah, that fog is thick. Come on, cool homie. That Wooloo might be in real trouble. Hop, what are you doing? I'm supposed to be coming with you. Hop! He's gone. 
What happened to Hop? This is mad. I can't even see my ho- own hand in front of my face. I think I get now why this place is off limits. Hmm? Hmm? That was that. What in the? Lord. Three question marks appeared. Nice. Art score bunny. That is weird. Also, I don't like this music. It's kind of. I can't hit it. Mysterious Pokemon's gaze is fixed on you. What? The move had no effect on it. Wait, Hop, what are you doing? Ember. Pass through it again. The move had no effect? Roar. This is scary. Gulhami, I can't see anything. You okay? Ember. Pass through it again. More fog, I can't see Score Bunny now. What just happened? I can't see anything. What happened? Ah! Oh, cool, honey. No oh, way. Well, Lee, how did you manage to find your way here? Your pants with the directions. You also always get lost. Oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two, and you never showed. Of course I came looking for the both of you. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to re- rescue that Wooloo. Oh good, he's safe. Meh. The little chap's just fine. Though all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds, but it took courage to come in here all the same, and I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. At least that Wooloo's all right. Yeah, cool, Hammy? I thought we had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacked. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? It seemed a load stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. And it just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really. They seemed to pass right through it. Your moves pass right through it? So the fearsome Pokemon they say live in the slumbering weld. Are, are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough and maybe the two of you can be the ones who, to reveal the truth someday. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be all right now that I'm here with you. Even if we did get an earful from Lee, what an experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. Don't care. See ya. Oh. Guess I gotta. Namu and Behe. Also, wasn't there only one Badoo earlier? And there's doubles. Fa. Well now, isn't Score Bunny just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? Here we are, a bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy your little self a po- at the Pokemon Center. 
Maybe some potions or something. Remember that score bunny will battle to the very end for you. So don't you go pu pu pushing the poor deer too hard. Bah. And you, score bunny, look after my little cool hummy. Come to rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Why? Hey, where'd score bunny go? I thought you were right there. What happened to you? Hold on, let me look in my bag. Yay, I got Pokeballs. Yay. I mean, got Pokeballs. Here we go, this is quite the big step, you know. My first step to be toward becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Grookey a bit by having it battle against Pokemon in the tr tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great red and white ball mark on out front. On front. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. Nope, I don't want Rookities. I want Squirvet. Where's that Nicket I was looking for? Not a Squirvet. There's one, I see one. I found one. Yeah! Yay! This is exactly what I wanted. I'm not even gonna attack it. Because I don't need to. Yeah! So happy now. I got a new friend. Oh, never mind, I didn't. Yay, I got a new friend. I'm gonna use Nick it first. Go and look around. Hey, mister. Ugh, I don't want to sit. The world you see out the window of a train, it never stops changing. Isn't it lovely? Uh, I guess. The ultimate Charizard. Sneaky, sneaky. I want to buy something. Yeah, I got so much money, I can buy anything I want. It's black, I mean, yeah, the white and black. This hat. There, I don't look the same anymore. don't look the same anymore. Yay! Can I just skip the lab and go somewhere else? I think, can I come in?
Man. Oops, wrong building. This one. Hi, Charizard. Roar. Oops, I forgot to read that part. I've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. Every, everything in here looks fascinating. Bow work. Oh, hello, little puppy. So cute. I like you. What is it today, Leon? Looking for info on another never before seen super strong Pokemon? I I wish you'd stop with uh, uh, with these outlandish requests. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a little is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. What can I say about Sonia? Well, I like the way she cooks. <laughs> she makes food you can do gobble down in a flash. Tsk, what kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were, we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's, professor's assistant. This is Kulhami. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Set him on the right path, would you? Where you going? <sighs> what does he think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh, looks like you've got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Hi, Bzert. Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh, sorry, so tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? You bet. Well said. In that case, I'll make it so you can use the Pokedex on the Rotom phone. You obtained the Pokedex. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my Gran. Could you let Gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in the house down along Route 2. Alright. So. Yay, I got... Fine, I'll do the Charizard pose. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokedex, yeah? I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. You obtained a potion. You put the potion in your bag's medicine pocket. It's a potion. Use it when your Pokemon's HP, their hit points, gets low. HP is like a Pokemon's stamina. You can even use potions during battle. Knowledge is power. It's a good idea to talk to lots of different people and read everything you can on your journey. All right, let's go. See, let's go see. Let's go train Nicket. Got your Pokédex from Sonia. Now I guess it's time to meet lots of different Pokémon and start building up a strong team. But battling strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way. Not, not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we've got Pokemon Centers. Luckier yet, they're dead easy to spot. They look the same wherever you go. Come on, cool hammy. I bet, bet you've never been inside one. Level with me, cool Tommy. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? Yes. Then the future champions got you covered. 
First things first, you talk to the lady at the counter if you want your Pokemon healed up. And your Pokemon you catch are kept in computers like the one you can find here, see? After all, you can only bring six Pokemon with you on the road in your party. The potions they sell at the Pokemon Earth got me out of a real rough spot the other day. If you two kids are Pokemon trainers, you might want to buy some potions. Cheers, I'm already good though. I'm heading to Rope 2, Cool Hammy. Come find me, maybe, when you're done here. Alright, well, bye, Hop. And also, th this is it for today. See you next time. Bye.